Yo, what is up team? Welcome back. So today I'm super pumped, man. We are headed over to Tackle Direct to pick up our new swordfish reel. So guys, I had purchased, um, probably not the smartest purchase, but I purchased a Hooker 1080 uh, electric reel. So it's the, it's the 80 wide from Penn International um, and then Hooker Electric down in Florida uh, sets up a, a, you know the electric reel component to it. I ordered it with a line counter as well as the um, the level line, so that added quite a bit. So this reel was to the tune of 4,700 bucks. <laughs> so uh, probably not the wisest purchase, but you know the last couple sword trips um, we really were putting the Shimano Beastmaster to its test. We could feel the drag heating up and. Uh, Last year, we, we fought one that actually fried up the motor. Uh, luckily, Shimano was nice enough to send us a new one, but uh, I'm heading over to Tackle Direct. We're gonna pick up the new reel, get it spooled, hopefully, uh, provided they're not too busy. I wanna get in and out, because it's Friday and all the out-of-towners are coming, so there's gonna be a bunch of traffic. So I'll catch up with you guys at Tackle Direct, and uh, we'll go from there, I'm so excited. All right, guys, we're at Tackle Direct now. So let's see if there's any chance I can get out of here without buying anything else except for the line for the reel. Um, every time I come here, I decide I need something aside from what I'm going in to get. So let's see if I can't restrain myself today. We'll see. This place has been pretty good to me over the years, guys. They have everything. They can get you anything. Super pumped. Great store. Hopefully they let me video, we'll see. Oh, it's silver, whoa. I thought it was gonna be gold. That's all right. I actually kind of secretly wanted silver. Very cool. Dude. Look at that bad boy. <laughs> yeah, man. Dude, that's awesome. All right, so line counter here. Level wind. 80. I just already got the plug on there. Dude. Pumped. That's awesome. Ethan, what's up, brother? Ethan hooked it up, guys. Hey, yeah, yeah. We're going to make you famous, all right? <laughs> Palm. Look at that thing, guys. That is so cool. They're going to... Boys are going to spool it up for us. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. I had to get more things. Couldn't help myself. I just got a little Tormentor bird and a couple of little squids just to make up some rigs for... Inshore trolling for Spanish and King mackerel and uh, you know mahi and bonita. So of course I spent extra money as always But uh, I'm gonna head back to the boat hook that bad boy up to power learn how to use it They literally gave me like five step instructions on how to use it That's about it from from hooker electric. So but it seems very self-explanatory So I'll catch up with you guys back at the boat. We'll see you All right guys brief detour. I was heading up to the boat uh, I got word there was a little wave up at my local spot, so I might go surf for a little bit. I tortured the wife, drug her along. Say hi, wife. Hi, wife. Yeah, she's in a good mood as always, so we're going to head up to the beach, then I'm going to head over to the boat. We'll see. Am I on video? Say hi to the world. Hi, world. How you doing? Nice to see you. You excited to go to the beach? I'm so excited that I think, I'm super pumped. I think you need a drink. Maybe, but I, this is not, this is not you need. this is just hydration. Roger that. So here we go, off to the beach. Maybe I'll get to surf a little bit, then we're going to go play with the Rio Rigger up. We are back at the boat. Get a chance to take a look at this bad boy a little bit closer. So, again, the boys at Tackle Direct were able to find me a 3,000 yard spool of the 80 pound Daiwa J braid, alright? Um, again, Penn International, this is an 80 wide, set up to a hooker electric reel. Um, so this bad boy has the line counter. It's got, no, the line counter here, rather. It's got the 
level wind so that's pretty cool over here i believe is the on off button and i'm pretty confident this is actually the going to put you on and off on and off uh, with regards to the electric function to it so pretty cool guys um this is the box that came in so we got the real clamps rod clamps i should say and this is really the only literature that it came with it came with a brochure and then it came with uh where was it just <laughs> these instructions that's about it um so i'm gonna go ahead and read these instructions get this bad boy set up all right guys so this is what we were using this is the shimano Beastmaster. the boys went ahead and took the liberty of buying me an awesome sword rod from tackle direct so we got it matched to that this thing's awesome uh, so i'm gonna go ahead and remove the Beastmaster and put the new pen on so we'll see all right team so i'm about to pick up a five thousand dollar reel <laughs> take her outside into the cockpit put it on this rod I don't feel like waiting for help. I'm too excited. So let's see here. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah. She fits pretty good. All right. She's definitely pretty heavy. That's for sure. Uh, so definitely at end game, I think a swivel rod holder will be pretty beneficial. So let's see, guys. So here's the plug that is provided. Zach was under here uh, not yesterday the day before and, and put this plug in so hopefully it works we'll see Does she fit uh oh oh yeah there we go uh seems a little loose huh all right we got power <laughs> check it out the little hooker chick comes up <laughs> that's so cool I don't know if you guys can see the hooker chick. That's pretty neat. All right, now let's try and figure out how to work it. Just pour a little out here. Put a little bit there. All right, now, so that's free spool. I guess there's no clicker. So it says I pulled out 31 feet. I'm assuming that's 31 feet. So we'll engage it. So now we're off. And now we're reeling. <laughs> Need real fast. <laughs> that's so cool. <laughs> All right, that's awesome. So we're at four feet now. That's got a really. So guys, just right off the bat, I, I don't know if you can see that or not. So that counter, not only is it a in feet, which the Shimano Beastmaster Beastmaster was not in, seems much more accurate. That definitely looks like four feet that we have out. So let's. Pull a little bit more line out and we'll see look at that line counter too nice heavy duty line counter this thing's awesome guys oh i'm so excited so accurate too all right so that's 50 feet we pulled out all right so now we're at 50 feet engage the reel and i'm pretty confident it's just you know your free spool you're at strike and then it's just a basic you know international over here and then you just have the separate you know electric over here so it seems pretty straightforward so then all we got to do so say we want to set the hook boom we're in slow it down spin this way it goes a lot faster look at that wow it's got a lot of wobble let's see if we can't mitigate that wobble by putting it in the in the other oh you know what it's probably not on tight enough maybe i don't know we'll see oh, that's on yeah maybe that's the problem I don't want to tell you enough. I gotta put the clamp on. All right, guys. So the reel works. Zach's setup works. I'm pumped. Uh, I'll figure out why it's shaking so much. All right, team. So easy fix on that um, shaking issue. So the reel handle is not supposed to spin when you're in the electric mode. So um, all you got to do is take it out of the. I had it in low gear. So you pop it into high gear. So low gear. You can manually crank high gear she's not engaged and then when we engage the electric whoop, i'm in free spool still learning still learning now when we engage the electric 
Easy peasy, she's not moving. Look at that, guys. <laughs> very cool, very cool. I'll whip in a bimini real quick, do a cat's ball loop to loop connection on our wind on, and uh, we're ready to roll. Uh, maybe go on Sunday, I'm not sure yet. Uh, the weather's kind of iffy. I'm on a little stretch here where I'm working quite a bit too. I don't have more than one day off in a row for a while. So um, I don't know, I may just wait till the week, but we'll see you guys. I'm super pumped, that thing looks awesome. As always, hit that like button, subscribe. More videos coming up, guys. I just figured I'd show you, you know, our new badass reel, you know, and you could come to Tackle Direct with me and, you know, check that sucker out. But, man, that thing is awesome. Look at that setup, guys. That puts us in a whole new class, I think, when it comes to dealing with these swords. So I'll see you guys out on the water, and we'll employ this bad boy to kill some big swords because they're out there. Yeah.